welcome back to my channel. Y'all, it has been a minute since I vlogged. It's been a minute since I did anything content creating wise, but that's not what we're here for. What we're here for. And not for the clickety clacks either, but it's about that time. Six bad bras flying in that night. But no, y'all, the time has come for my family and I to say toodles to Hawaii. So I wanted to vlog my journey like I did when we moved from Kansas to Hawaii. So I decided to vlog us moving. So today is Friday. I'm not sure the exact date, but they come and pack up our house on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So, y'all, right now, we are basically just like purging, getting rid of stuff, um, donating clothes, donating to rise old toys, and just organizing because with the military, they do come and pack up your house, but you still have to go through your stuff and organize it. Like, you just can't have a junky house and be like, okay, pack it. What's up? What's up? My husband is so annoying. <laughs> But yes, y'all, I have missed y'all. I have missed y'all. And maybe we'll sit down and talk in another video. I don't know. I've been going through a lot. And, um, you know, some things y'all will never know because y'all know I'm not that type. Um, but one thing I will share is it's probably already out by now. But um, I did lose my Nana back in May of this year. Um, it was a very, 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 very hard loss. Um, my Nana has been a part of my life since I was four years old. And now my girl is gone. She is gone. And I took it very hard. And I still can't come to terms with it sometimes. Like, like two weeks ago, I just randomly started crying. My husband was like, what's wrong? And I was like, I can't believe my Nana's gone. Like my Nana was me and I was like biggest, biggest, biggest fans. Like she was rooting for us. She was always praying for us. And that was my girl. Me and her would go back and forth, baby. We would go head to head, but that's my girl. That's my girl. That's the beat to my Nana. I miss her so much and I just can't believe she's gone. And I had called my stepmom the other day, and I was like, who told Nana to die? I'm like, girl, stop playing, come back. But, um, yes, but I'm doing good, and I miss her, and I don't want to talk about it too much, but that's one thing that has happened in my life drastically. But other than that, you know, life has been life in, and I've been getting through it. I'm still in therapy, and even with me moving, y'all, I get to keep my therapist. <laughs> They approved it like, I think it was like three weeks ago, three weeks ago. Yes, yeah, so I still get to keep my therapist. Um, we leave, we leave Hawaii September 1st. So excited, I'm so excited for this new chapter. Everyone's excited, down to the kids. Um, Moo will be a junior this year. Yeah, she will be a junior this year. I'm so proud of my girl. She's been working. She got a new job. She's just been doing her thing. And Soraya has been Soraya. She's been doing her thing. Still getting studio for year. Because that's my girl. That's my girl. That's my girl. And she'll be going to fourth grade when we move. So, um, my husband, he's still doing his thing. You know, being my man. Thank you to my man. <laughs> Then my man, you think you tell my man? Yeah, then my man, my man, my man. I don't play about him, okay? I follow my husband anywhere, and that's on everything. But yes, he's about to drag your girl across the country again. But yes, y'all, so I just wanted to, you know, get back into this, this swing of creating content. Now, I will speak on that some more in another video. But right now, y'all, it's just one day at a time. Like, content creating has not been a priority for me and I love y'all deep I do I do I don't just say that but I love y'all I love the community I built on YouTube Instagram Facebook it like my supporters are the real MVPs um 
even in this journey, I've met some people, built friendships, like I truly appreciate, you know, all that YouTube has done for me, especially, you know, I've been able to provide for my family. Yeah, that's, you know, it has been my bread and butter and I'm just thankful and I'm blessed, y'all. <laughs> We are blessed, we are blessed in the city, we're blessed in the field. Yes, but I've just been transforming, truly, as a person, as a woman, as a mom, as a wife. Um, my heart is full, even though my heart's been broken, my heart is full, and I'm taking it one day at a time. So right now, we just purging, cleaning, and I just wanted to introduce the vlog. Say what's up to y'all. Mm, 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 mm. Where you at? Where you at? Drop a comment down below and let your girl know what y'all been up to. Y'all miss me? I miss y'all. I really did. I really did, y'all. And um, just thank you. Thank you to the people that show me love. Thank you to the people that reached out to me. Someone sent me an email. I have more than one email, but it's this one email. And it really blessed my spirit because my Nana had just passed. Like I was heading to Virginia to go to her funeral and it like blessed me in a major way. I started crying. So shout out to my supporter, Willie Grant. Um, please, I know if you see this video, you comment on every video, I would like to know your real name so I could like thank you. But I'm just going off her YouTube name and her email. But you really touched me, and I appreciate it, and I love you for that. Thank you so, so much. Um, but yeah, y'all ain't gonna rant and rumble too much so y'all can see me purge, see me clean. We're getting rid of a lot of stuff. Like, we're getting rid of our dining room table. We're buying a new one. We're getting a new bedroom set, so I'm gonna be decorating. Y'all know I'm gonna do a house tour, 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 tour. Um, also an empty house tour. So I'm just excited, ready for another chapter. I feel like I've already been in a new chapter because I'm definitely not the same woman that I was the last time I was on the internet. And I will admit that I'm not into the internet. Um, I'm really not. And it's something that I cannot force anymore. You know, no matter how much I love content creating, when I want to get off the internet, I want to get off the internet. Like it's just not for me it's just y'all i can go on and on about how i feel about the internet and how i feel it has ruined society how i feel how it has ruined like this generation like the the internet can be a beautiful thing but it can also be an ugly place and you know people can benefit from the internet you know i've made money from the internet but I just don't want to be like everybody else. I don't want to conform to what everybody is doing. Like logging in, you're looking, you're literally looking at everyone doing the same exact thing. And I'm, I'm not an it girly, y'all. And I don't want to be no it girly. And I'm just Shanice Nicole. I've said that from the jump. I've always said that. And I always say true to myself. And I'm just not, I'm not. I'm not with the foolishness and I was watching another YouTuber she used to be big and she said she just felt like she was well she's still big but she's not where she used to be and she said she just felt like she was in a fake world surrounded by fake people and just conforming and living a life. She was like, yeah, she had it all. She had the, the nice house, the luxuries, getting the brand deals, but she lost herself as a person. And I've never gotten to that point where I allowed the internet to change me. But um, being on this journey, I've seen a lot of people growth and I've seen a lot of people change and I've seen a lot of people follow trends and it's just like, I always stay true to you, baby. It's nothing wrong with elevating. It's nothing wrong with growth. But stay true to you. And then, and I'm a, I'm afraid to head to. I ain't doing this no more. So um, yes, y'all. So let's get into it. Let's go see what Mr. Robinson doing. Then my man. Thank you to my man. Y'all, my husband is the best. He really is. But y'all, drop a comment down below. Let me know what's up. <laughs> Shout out to my peeps. My peeps know who they are. They was uplifting me and didn't even know it because I was going through such a rough patch. But God is good. I'm good. My family's good. I have no complaints. Every day ain't gonna be peaches and cream. But I wake up. 
I'm healthy, I'm happy, I'm at peace. So that's all I can thank God for. That's it. That's all I can thank God for. So let's get into this cleaning. So this video is not, it's gonna be broken up. Um, I will do like part one, part two, all it. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. <laughs> make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you're new to my channel make sure you subscribe and we're just gonna take it from there y'all i'm not gonna say i'm doing this doing it because it'll be a lie <laughs> but yes y'all <laughs> trying to act like you don't love me Oh my god, y'all. It looked like somebody just ran through my house and just tore it up. Literally. True. Robinson is um, spray painting our patio set. Um, we bought this patio set like when we first got here. And you know, it's been sitting outside. We weren't really using the table. We didn't get this here. It's not from Canada, bro. Yeah, we bought this here. We got it. Canada. We didn't have nothing in Kansas. We were sitting on your chairs. I got videos to prove it. Mm -hmm. We bought this here. Oh, man, I always be loud and wrong. Anyway, my man always in my business, like I said. Mm -hmm. But, um, cause we got it from Walmart. We got it from Walmart. We wanted the one from the PAs, but it was um, overpriced. You got this one on sale. That's the only reason why you got it. But anyways, he's spray painting it matte black because it had it got like rusted and stuff. And we used the chairs in the front, like all of us sit in the front, but we didn't really use the table. Especially like when we let the backyard like go downhill, we won't take care of the backyard. We just was like, F it. And I just had one chair out here for when he would grill. But other than that, we won't give him no love. So he spray painted it and we're gonna I'm gonna decorate our patio area at the new house, make it a little cute, a little cute. Got a couple of ideas, um, but yes, yeah, so I'm excited. So I'm about to get up and I'm frying some fish and potatoes, you know, to feed the hungry man and to feed my kids. Well, we're going to work at five. Um, but yeah, I'm doing the kitchen and then after I do the kitchen, I'm almost done the kitchen. And after I do the kitchen, I'm going upstairs. I'm gonna do my side of the office. I don't know why it's more. And then I'm gonna finish my closet. I bought some boxes to pack up my sneaker collection. But um, let's see, the, the movers are gonna pack up the rest of my stuff. I just wanted to pack up my own sneakers. Cause I don't know. Don't be looking at my shoes. <laughs> and I'm probably gonna pack my Josh shoes too. You just don't know it yet. But anyways, yeah, that's it. That's all that's going on. Y'all look at this. Look at this. Look at this. It's just like a mess. It's just stuff everywhere. I just went grocery shopping. It's just like stuff everywhere. Like, oh my God. There's stuff everywhere. I finally took out the all the clothes. It was like a pile of clothes.
Go ahead, move. I think this is smooth as ride, girl. Hold on. I gotta wait till we get to the stop sign. <laughs> You on the you on the wrong side of the road, Moo. You <sighs> just be so unbothered. <laughs> That's why I don't be letting you drive. <laughs> you just be like, oh my bad. Don't hit my man. That's enough. You see, you ain't even check behind you. Somebody, don't you hit my man? Why ain't nobody gonna hit me? Move. When you back up, you gotta look in your mirror. You just be going in reverse and saying, Mark, I look right there. You gotta. I look right there. What about this side? I look did you, right there. Did you see if any kids was coming? <laughs> <laughs>